you were at the track tonight. What happened? Uh, uh, well, they went into turn uh, three and uh, one and two, and uh, someone spun out, and the guy went after. He got out of his car, you know, and then Tony came back around, and I don't know if he was trying to throw a helmet at Tony or just point at him, like you know, because I, I I've been coming to the race, dirt races for thirty some years, you know, I've seen drivers, you know, get out of the car, but he just it looked like Tony just. Uh, fish tail then he hit the guy next thing I know the guy is laying all over on the ground but uh, right now I, I'm st- I'm still in the pitch right now and uh, the only co- the only hauler left is Tony's I, I watched earlier and they uh, they uh, made uh, the, only, the thing that made me uh, very suspicious was uh, uh his sprint car was already loaded up in the hauler, and the rest of the in that class that he was running with wasn't even loaded up. But they, he was loaded up in his uh, in his hauler, and they made him uh, load it back up. You know, unload it. So uh, who who is they? The police? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So and, look, uh, I want to I want to I want to understand correctly. So you're you're sitting about start finish line, right? You're at center grandstands, and this incident uh, happened. Well, I, I'm past the I was past the the, the start finish line, going into turn one. Okay. And, and the then, incident uh, and the incident happened, and you said turn one or turn two. Turn well, the incident happened at turn two. Actually, you know, you you still got cops sitting over there in turn two, where the incident happened, and right now, like. They, they moved all the haulers away from Tony Stewart's uh, sprint car hauler. It's just his hauler sitting there with an unmarked uh, sheriff's car. What was what was the what was the reaction among the crowd? I mean, because we've seen. I mean, I'm a I'm a race fan. You know, you see drivers uh-huh. retaliate while they're in their cars. But what was the reaction of everyone around you when I mean Tony Stewart's sprint car hit uh, one of the competitors? Well, people didn't even realize that. I'm watching it. It's like. You know, it's like, all right, another night of Tony Stewart drama because that's what happened. I was here last year when I'm sure you reported on that story last year when that girl got parallel, well, pretty much paralyzed, you know, at the same racetrack, same time, same, you know, last year. Now, when he hit, when he, so, so uh, there was contact made in turn two. They threw the yellow flag. Dude stopped, well, got I out of the... I don't know where the contact was. I don't know oh. where the contact was. That, that's where the car spun out. The car ended up in turn right. two, so they throw the yellow. So the field comes back around. The guy right. is standing right. there in the track, like, waving or something at Stewart. And then Stewart... Yeah, I, I, yeah and he fishtailed it. And the next thing I know, the, the guy that got out of the car is laying on the track. Yeah. and then Was he moving? Uh, no, he was just... Well, it was a far distance, but the guy was just laying there. You know what I'm saying? And it's what like, happened uh, after what happened after that at the track? Well, we sat there, you know, the the sheriff's department came, the the town, the city ambulance came, and then they called the race because you know, they were the curfew, eleven o'clock. They called the race, so we came in the pits. Well, and we, when we got in the pits, Tony's car is already loaded up in the hauler. Now everybody that he was racing with, um, their cars, um, they weren't even loaded up. So, uh, and then there's like four or five sheriffs over by his hauler, and uh, they made him unload the car. Like, they they moved all the haulers away from Tony Stewart's uh, sprint car hauler. It's just his hauler sitting there with an unmarked uh, sheriff's car. What was what was the what was the reaction among the crowd? I mean, because we've seen. I mean, I'm a I'm a race fan. You know, you see drivers retaliate while they're in their cars. But what was the reaction of everyone around you when, I mean, Tony Stewart's sprint car hit one of the competitors? Well, people didn't even realize that. I'm watching it. It's like, you know, it's like, all right, another night of Tony Stewart drama because that's what happened. I was here last year when I You were at the track tonight. What happened? Uh, uh, well, they went into turn uh, three, and, uh, one and two. And uh, someone spun out, and the guy went after. He got out of his car, you know, and then Tony came back around. And I don't know if he was trying to throw a helmet at Tony or just point at him. Like, you know, because I, I, I've been coming to the race, dirt races for 30-some years. You know, I've seen drivers, you know, get out of the car. But he just, it looked like Tony just 
uh, fishtail and he hit the guy. And next thing I know, the guy unloaded. So, uh, who, who is they? The police? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So and, uh, I want to I want to I want to understand correctly. So you're you're sitting about start finish line, right? You're at center grandstands, and this incident uh, happened. Well, I, I'm past the I was past the the, the start finish line, going into turn one. Okay. And, and the then, incident uh, and the incident happened, and you said turn one or turn two. Turn well, the incident happened at turn two. Actually, you know, you you still got cops sitting over there in turn two, where the incident happened. And right now, laying all over on the ground. But uh, right now, I, I'm st- I'm still in the pits right now. And uh, the only co- the only holler left is Tony's. I I watched earlier, and they uh, they uh, made a uh, the, the thing that made me uh, very suspicious was uh, uh, his sprint car was already loaded up in the hauler, and the rest of the in that class that he was running with wasn't even loaded up, but they. He was loaded up in his uh in his hauler, and they made him uh, load it back up. You know, I'm sure you reported on that story last year when that girl got parallel, well, pretty much paralyzed. You know, at the same racetrack, same time, same you know last year. Now, when he hit, when he so so uh, there was contact made in turn two. They threw the yellow flag. Dude stopped, well, got I out of the... I don't know where the contact was. I don't know oh. where the contact was. That, that's where the car spun out. The car ended up in turn right. two, so they throw the yellow. So the field comes back around. The guy right. is standing the guy... there in the track, like, waving or something at Stewart, And then Stewart. Yeah, I, I, yeah it, it, and he fishtailed it. 